stampers welcome to watch it weekly wednesday i'm jill and i'm here to show you a cool layout idea that actually makes four cards i received this idea from a trade from france martin let me show you and i love this geometric kind of shape and i'm going to show you how easy it is to do here's a template that i've made on how to cut your six by six designer series paper these are the one and five eighths marks all the way around and this is the cut line you just take a six by six piece of designer series paper, and I'm using the Settles pack right here to make the cards that I've made. I'm gonna lay it down here on my sheet that has the measurements, and I'm gonna go one and five eighths over, and I'm gonna make a little mark on my designer series paper, and just turn it around, one and five eighths again, turn it around, one and five eighths again and one more time so you've got those little slash marks around your designer series paper now i'm going to take our trimmer and there's two different ways to do this so first we're going to trim it from this one and five eighths to the other side let me show how that is done let's just get the trim Okay, so there we go. Now I want to also put it back together and just put a post-it note there to go on the other side. So I'm going to turn that again, and then we have the one mark to the other mark, and we're going to trim that too. So it's at a diagonal. So now you've got four pieces to work with four cards. There's a different way if you don't even want to use the measurements of the one and five eighths. Let me show you. So I'm gonna take the point of the six by six and put it right there where the dark and the light match up and just pull, point it right there. Then I'm gonna take this point and go all the way to four inches. And guess what? That is the exact same thing as the one I just showed you with marking it. So I'm going to post a note this again, turn it, Put this little corner right there and this at the four inch mark. So you've got the same angle as you did before. And guess what? We have four different optional pieces. Let me bring in my cardstock and my designer series paper that I've already trimmed. I went ahead and just did our Highland Heather cardstock on the base of basic white. And then I'm gonna take another white, even smaller, quarter of an inch all the way around, put that on so it creates this nice frame. And then this piece right here. Now there's different ways you can go ahead and put this piece on. You could do it this way, you can flip it over and do it this way. You can do it on this side, on that side. So there's many different options. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it at the top right here and just adhere that down flat. I'm not gonna punch it up or anything. And that will be our focal point of this card. I'm gonna take this flower from the Darling Detail stamp set and with their dies and put it right there so it's on there. And then the saying I'm gonna use is from Layer in Leaves. Thank you so much. I love the script of this saying. And I'll show you some other cards that we've done with these that are horizontal and vertical. So it's nice to be able to use both to have the look that you want. So thank you so much. Let me show you some other ideas with this layout and the cut of the four different pieces. So that's just up in a different corner. And see how I did them on the right corner, on the left corner, this is just on the side. That's flipping it and doing it on the side again. So there's just, the options are endless to what you can make this layout be. I hope you can take this easy six by six layout and use it because it's amazing and it's so simple. If you like any of these products, click the links below. We'll see you next time on Watch It Weekly Wednesday.